Let's get into it, man. Now, if you guys need to pause, go ahead and pause. But today, we're going to get into everything that's wrong with this game and plus tons more stuff. But as you're seeing on the screen, new outfits on the way, new outfits on the rise, all right? We're going to break down everything, all right? Buckle up. Now, I've got a new uh, raid, and it's uh, it's going to be good. But the new festival's out, and as you can see, the prizes are amazing, man. Like, look at that, look at that. Ooh, we're getting the Android 17 drip, okay? As you see it right here, we're getting the God of Destruction. Yes, yes, with the festival. And we're getting the Gohan, okay? We're getting the Gohan trendy stuff. But the raid will be for the Tapion outfit, all right? Another Tapion outfit. It's the red one, to be specific. So go on and get your, yeah. Log in and get your, claim your 100 TP or STP, right? For free. Um, That's the option. Hopefully they bring the trendy Tapion so we can do this. All right, but um, here's future outfits to come. First will be Zeno, um, then it will be uh, Broly's. Um, after that, it will be uh, trash. But the armor for Vegeta and for Vegeta, Supreme Kai of Time, her outfit will come. Then the Pride Trooper, and that is the latest of updates. Here are extra outfits that we know are data mined. As you can see, Android 18s. We have Gohan when he was a kid. Um, that's pretty nice, right? And we have tracksuit, which I can't wait for, all right? We got Batman. I don't, I don't even understand why, but okay. Um, and with Gohan again, you know what I mean? That's coming. That's coming to the festival, so, you know, look up for that. Post Boy, I don't get it. Out of all outfits, why not Super Saiyan 4? Um, again, orange, uh, okay, whatever. Why not Super Saiyan 4, okay? Why not Super Saiyan 4? But let me get into the components. Like, let me let me break this down for you guys, right? Because I've getting a lot of questions in my Discord and my followers, all that. You guys have been telling me, what's going on with this? Why is this like this? What's going on with the color palettes? Oh, man, this is trash. It's customization. I can't take it. I, that sucks. Look at that. But let me explain to you what's happening with custom cover, <laughs> custom customization. Trendy. Over here, we say trendy. What's going on with the trendy? Now, it works like this, guys. And every single outfit that we can customize, it only goes to one to four little brackets. As you're seeing right here, you only get four color changes. They cannot go to five. They cannot make six. They can only do four. So you have to compensate for a lot <laughs> when it comes basically to the other outfits and the other colors. Like I'm showing you right now, th th these gloves, these are the only gloves in the game that have let you customize three different ways but these are the only ones i look i check everything else the gloves the boxing gloves let you customize three different ways now the trendy work clothes let you customize four different ways four different color palettes that's what we're looking for we're looking for four we want four changeable color palettes man that's what we're looking for in an outfit and we're not getting that at all we're getting one color palette which is crazy because as you're seeing right here you can do so much good stuff like right now i'm just tinkering trying to make them you know a tack on titan type jacket i don't know but this allows you to do that is the four color package that's why the trendy suit and the trendy work clothes are so sought after because they have four components for you to do that other outfits don't really let you you know what i'm saying like these ones do this has three you know unbeknownst to you it does have three um, you just have to have a certain kind of pants, but these pants, as you're seeing right here, the time patrollers, which you start out with, they let you do four, four color palettes to change. That is, to me, is game breaking. I don't care what you say, because you're able to do four different colors on one outfit or just one article of clothing, just like the shoes here, the, the fashion shoes that we're able to change socks, shoe, bottoms and front and back. That's four different colors. That's what we're always looking for when to uh, change to trendy. It's four different color palettes. We'll settle for three, but to have just one is crazy, but four different color palettes. So that makes a good custom outfit. Like this King Kai is four. This Piccolo is three. That's good. Three to four is good, but four is preferably. Four is amazing because you can do so much with changing the colors when it comes to these color palettes doing four. Okay, that's why I like these outfits so much and I want trendy outfits for everybody and everything. I've been advocating this since, I don't know, 2017, honestly. I look back at my videos and I'm saying it there, <laughs> like with a shitty mic and all that. But it's just one of those things where I'm, I want what's best for us and what's best for this game. 
And what's best for this game and us is for have more creativity. And how do we do that? Expanding the colors and expanding the outfits, expanding what they're doing already right now. Massive updates are true because these are massive updates. These are game changing things. This is creating more content for us. Not only that, we're getting to play the game and enjoy the game all over again if you add certain things and outfits. Now they've been doing that lately with the Zamasu and finally we got, we got a Kai outfit that stands alone and has four different color palettes, man. And I can't stress this enough. This is the probably best outfits we've been getting lately, okay? Now I know a lot of people want different things. Like this is only one, you know, but it has four components with it. It has top, bottoms, hands, and um, shoes. So um, like I'm saying here, they even let us do it with the cast characters. This is what I mean. This is three, three for her top and three for the bottoms. It's fine. As long as we get to change different things, but they messed around, right? This is what I'm talking about. When it comes to three, sometimes it sucks because it's just the belt. We can't change her stockings or, you know what I mean, at all. We can only change her belt. So that's kind of a waste because it's like, I'd rather change her stockings than the belt buckle. I don't care about the belt buckle. I want to make a team rocket. I don't care about no belt buckle. You know what I mean? Um, other ways, it's pretty cool because like, there's only two. That's fine because then you can work with two. Like here, I made like Videl. Like, uh, different type of team colors. Like, here I try to do our Raleigh. You know what I mean? Like, because we can only do two color palettes. You know, we can only have a white. We can only have red. Again, fine with that. As long as they up the Annie's. Now, see, what they did with the feet is only three. <laughs> which is wild. You know what I mean? It's only three with the feet. When we have four with the stuff. So, when we get this, this is to let you guys know how far they're going to go. We are only be able to change two components when we get this top and Videl's clothes, which is coming soon, as I just showed you earlier in the video. Um, but yeah, like I was saying earlier, uh, but you can only do one style changes for some of them. But those one style changes could be good as long as you add more to it. Like I said, the mummy wrap, but, but let's talk about the hats. The hats are ridiculous because the hair still shows. I absolutely hate it. I absolutely hate this. I really do. Because I it used to show, right? where you put a hat on and they didn't show this. They didn't show your hair, right? As you're seeing right now, they did not show your hair. This is, I don't, I forgot, I can't remember the date, but this is a while back, this is years ago. Okay, this is a, this is years ago video and it's not showing your hair through. Your hair's not bleeding through, your hair's not, you know, I'm a bald character. As y'all saw, y'all just saw, I was a bald character and they just added hair when you put on something. I don't like that, it never used to be like that. So, Dimps Bandai, what's going on? Why are y'all adding things like that? It's pretty stupid. Now, this is how it should be. Like on your Namekian, you you don't grow hair. So why are we growing hair with the human or sands? I just don't get that. Like, like you, you, why would y'all change that? You know what I mean? Like, it's nice they took the little doilies out of some of them, but as you can still see, like they kind of left them in. I can understand that because his whole head's showing. Um, what else? His antennas. I, I still don't understand that. I don't get this at all. Why are the horns bleeding through the mask? I just say that just like this. It's kind of stupid. <laughs> it really is stupid. They make some dumb changes in this game. Now, here's another thing I thought was weird too, is that um, when it comes to females, there's a little female bias in this game. Females can wear anything, but males can't. Like, right, I'm gonna go on this female list and watch. Look at this. Females can literally wear any accessory. Right? Look at this. They have no limits. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. Oh, Majin, <laughs> right? And that's not even a female exclusive. That's just, you know, Majin exclusive. But look, female, everything is female exclusive. This whole thing is just female. It's like, they, they just want stuff for females. I see more male characters, but you know, you get it. If you like your female character, go crazy. But that's kind of wild to me how we can't rock the Kepler wig as a male. But we can rock any other wig. The, the females can rock any other wig. I don't get that. Like, fix that. What is wrong with y'all? Like, these tiny little fixes can really improve this game massively. But y'all won't do it. It's like how like rather stick to this like like why make these weird changes and then bounce to another update that's another two years away like it's weird but again man like it it has more favoritism towards female characters it really does it's like they want you to make female characters it's kind of crazy look at this no limitations now let me show you the male side right okay I'm a ball character so you're just adding hair on to me like an idiot but um as you're going down watch watch the exclusion 
it's gonna take. So you're thinking, okay, okay. Well, where's it at, CKG? I don't see it yet. Wait, wait, we got one. That's the Majin Mark, like always. My, my apologies. But we're gonna keep going down. Hold on, hold on. Only to where it gets like towards the end is when we can't do it the The only thing females can wear is the Ox King's helmet. That's the only thing females can wear is the Ox King's helmet. That's it. Males, super exclusive. Like, right, right, super exclusive. You start to go down here and look, we, we, we can cut off. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? We can't wear no type of uh, hats and stuff. But this also was very alarming is the cross dressing that they're willing to do in this game. Again, it's very female prone because male females can wear some male stuff, a lot of male stuff, but I, why are, are the males wearing female stuff? I don't get why we can wear Kale's clothes. What, I don't understand that whatsoever. I don't get that. It must be a new thing. Well, yeah, it must be really relatively new because the last time we did something like this was Rip Rand's outfit or something like that, right? <laughs> we got Root Rand and Pride Trooper and all this, but look at this, Videl's pregnant gear. Why are we rocking that? Why are we rocking a skirt that, that they turn into a romper or jorts? Like we have to rock a romper. It's kind of weird. I don't, I'm not going to lie to you. I, I'm not really feeling it. <laughs> I'm not, I didn't go out and get the rest of the outfit. I just, I didn't really care because <laughs> like it was just boots and some hand oilies. I'll probably get them a little later, but hey, I do a couple of runs, try to get the clothes. I can't get the clothes. F that, right? Like, you know what I mean? I'm good. The RNG is undefeated in this game, and it always will be. I don't care what you say. The Super Soul ain't working, okay? It ain't working. But this it's just very alarming to me how, like, a lot of this stuff is exclusive. Like, we cannot wear the female. Like, if you're going to let us wear dresses and skirts and all this, why can't we wear the wigs? That's my only point. Like, why can't we wear the wigs? I can't wear a Kepler wig. Why, when I put on... Um, my hat. I don't grow hair. <laughs> like, right? Like, I have. I gotta. I got. You know what I mean? I don't get long hair. I gotta get this weird stuff, right? I can understand if you add hair on top of that and need the added hair. But I'm bald character. I'm a already bald character. What? What, what is the point? <laughs> a lot of these accessories are kind of wonky and stupid. They need to do little tweaks and fixes, and they'll be make this game and improve it so dramatically, man. Okay. I appreciate you guys rocking with me. We're at the 12 minute mark. But, um, like, uh, like, Grand Kai, why can't we get the rest of his, like, we're missing the back of his hair. Like, that, that's key. You know what I mean? We got the back of the hair with Yancha. Like, why? PyCon is a bald character anyway, so when I put on his thing, I should be bald. I just don't get this stuff. Adding hair sometimes is stupid. Okay, but let's get into the real rant. Let's get into the real BS of this. Now, what you're seeing is Zeno's outfit. Now, it's, not, it's only three parts custom changeable. And not even the sleeves, y'all. They did not do the sleeves, which is the dumbest thing you can do. But like I said earlier, they're compensating because they only have three color palettes. If they did this, it would have to be five, to be honest. And they can't do five. So what they did was they made it like four or three. I don't, I don't really truly know because I didn't buy it. I refuse to buy that garbage. I'm sorry. I'm not buying that if I cannot change it. It is not trendy if you cannot change the whole thing. Now, they put the shoes in here. You can't change the stockings, only the shoes. So they, they didn't even add the pants because they know you can't change the pants. Which, to be honest, shout out to my guy Lava. He had a good point where, well, we got battle suit, hero suit. We got tons of spandex. So that really doesn't matter. But it's, it's still, the point is, why not just add a different outfit? If this is the only thing we can do, why pay 200 TP or STP for this? Garbage. It's, it's absolute filth. Basura for my Spanish viewers, okay? It's trash, <laughs> right? I can't, I can't stand it. Now again, I'm demonstrating you, showing you how, okay, make, you know, adding the Zenos doesn't really matter because you can do any pants and blend any color and put any color. I understand that fully, man but I'm not with them not. Why add this outfit to begin with? And why make it five weeks, right? Like you had any outfit to do. They're really dropping the ball with these custom colorization colors. I say colorization, I'm sorry. Custom, customization, okay? Now they're adding the armor, you know, the Vegeta armor, which is trash. Cause the blue you're seeing, the sleeves and the pants, you can't change. So it's not trendy. It's not customizable. You can't do nothing but the armor. Which is good, but I still have these dumb sleeves that I can't change. Give us the Turles armor then, so we can change the colors. On Turles, it's only two components, but at least you can change. 
the two components now they're giving us stuff like vegeta where you can't change the blue at all but we can change everything else that's what their selling point is you can change the shoes we got tons of those shoes we got tons of those gloves i don't care about the gloves and shoes i care about the blue in the armor that was probably going to be the best piece of trendy material in the game and they dropped the ball same thing with supreme kaya time as you're seeing her crest the little chest piece is blue that stays blue everything in black we can customize but the chest stays blue it's stupid what like what type of detailing is this i don't get you dips and bandai like y'all dropping the ball it's like y'all do this stuff on purpose and then you're adding a paywall so we pay for this nonsense why would we pay for stuff that you half-assed because you did. I, I just don't get how modders can do a better job, bro. I just, it blows my mind how th this whole team and company been running this thing for nine years and you guys can't make subtle changes. Y'all refuse to. It's almost like people are brain dead. It's like a slap in the face. We'll take your money, but we won't do nothing for your benefit. It's just a weird thing. It's supposed to be a give and take, man. We pay for content. You guys give content. But doing this is dumb. Like you're seeing right now, we will change the lining, the sash, and the pink. So four components. We don't have so that. So basically, we have four components: the sleeves that are white, the lining, the pink, and the sash. We don't have a fifth color palette. So instead of just changing, I would say compensate the lining. They could have gave us the chest piece, but I understand how they can't give us the chest piece at the same time because it'll make it five color palettes, and they can't do that. They can only do four. So I understand the Supreme Kai of time, but I don't get the Vegeta one. Cause who cares about the tail? Like it's just really stupid. <laughs> like I'll only be honest with you. Now here's another thing I felt like was weird, right? I'm not gonna lie to you. Some of these prizes they've been giving us is weird, but you see how this is on the females? You see the two part components, two part components. That's what I'm looking for. Two part components where we can switch on and off. Maybe we can do the top, then we can do the bottoms. That's great, instead of making the whole thing one piece. You know, so you you have to rock this. And it's like, just let us rock the top and switch an individual. I like how they did that with the kale. But it, because it reminds me of the skirt thing. As you're seeing right here, how the skirt used to be white. Remember back in the day when you used to make characters and you had the skirt, and then the skirt top was always white. You can never change the color. Now, this is one thing Dips and Bandai actually did that was a, a, a straight W in the last few years. They let us change that feature. They added that feature. As you're seeing, we can now change the top. If you guys are real old veterans to this game, you know what I'm talking about, all right? I'll give you an example. I'm going to give you an example for those who don't know what I'm saying or don't know what I'm talking about. We weren't playing this game then. But back in the day, as you're seeing, when we put the top, it would bleed through. The shirt would bleed through. The bottom shirt, where it's orange, it would bleed through on the skirt. Now they sitch patched that. So when you put on the uniform, the skirt just goes up and there's no undershirt. Oh, massive W. Massive, massive W for this. Okay, now see, it's like a regular skirt. Now when you put the uniform on, it'll be a little different which is okay. See, you put the uniform on, you see the green still is there. The undershirt is still there on the uniform, which is nice feature. But when you go to um, this, it's not, which is great. I really like that. But let me show you what I'm talking about. Now I made a video a while back doing Him Himawari and I noticed a subtle change that the Bandai and Dips made. 2017 on the left, you see, the skirt was white tipped and we could use skirts on jackets. This is back when we can put skirts on jackets. We we were able to used to do that, guys. I would make um, Himiko Toga for My Hero. I would make so many characters with hoodies and jackets and stuff. Like, because you were able to do this, and now you're not. Fast forward, this is 2024, we still can't do it. But this was back in 2023, I noticed this, this weird, subtle change. Like, why do this, Bandai? Why mess with us like this? It was better, way better before. Like, let us put the jackets back on the skirts, man. What's wrong with y'all? Now, this used to bleed through, and I hated this. I hated the fact that the top would just stay white. I absolutely hate that. So that's why I don't use the hero one. I use the battle one, because the battle lets you change the top. Now, granted, it is kind of sucky, because it never matches the colors, ever. Like, yeah, like, <laughs> you're not going to match these colors. So, I mean, they gave us a little, eh? And then they gave us a little, uh, Like, right? You know what I mean? We good and bad, right? Um, but 
as it bleeds through. Like that was the problem I had. It was it bleeding through the clothes. Now again, you can blend so it doesn't bleed through, but it shouldn't have to bleed through. Y'all got one job to do, man. And that's so little quick edits. Why are y'all like just tinkering stuff that doesn't need to be tinkered with? It's just it's really, really, really disgusting. I'm not gonna lie to you, man. I hate using that word like that, but it is. <laughs> it is. Us content creators and us players, that is another change that they made that is very dumb. As you're seeing, if you get the hero turtle hero uh, turtle hermit hero costume or whatever, right? The Master Roshi lookalike thing. Now, you can change everything on the components, like I said. This has four components where you can change. But the sash no longer lets you do that. It's like the sash stuck on white. And not only that, the graphics don't even match. Remember how you go into, like, oh, what is that area? When you go see the Elder Kai and do the story mode, and it makes your, like, clothes look weird? That's what it's doing to these. It's like the clothes graphics become, like, the 3D or some shit. I don't know. Like, it's weird. Man. I cannot deal with that. Why did y'all change this? This makes it stupid. I have a, a black sash with a white uh, knot. <laughs> it is dumb, okay? But on females, it's not like that. Four changeable things. Four changeable things on the females. What happened? Why did you mess up the male one? Why did you tinker with the male? It was fine the way it was. It's fine the way it is. Bad dad was going on. Now here's another thing that was weird. Um, I put on the Broly clothes, right? I, I was just tinkering, right? Just tinkering with the Broly. I was messing with his moves. So I was like, man, when can on this clothes look like him? Right? And I know it's something weird, right? And if you don't have the top, like the pants are just the pants, which is cool, right? Like, that's fine. Um, the top is actually the necklace. So that you could have it separate, which is okay. It seems all right, right? Like, well, I'm just problem with that, CKG. What's your issue, bro? What's your issue, bro? I'll let my dad fight you, right? And he'll get beat up. But, I'm, but, but, but but look at this, right? If you put on the Broly full power drop, just the bottom, like the top alone is the bottoms kind of, because it's just the sash. So they they didn't do a necklace, they just gave you the sash. And then you can put on regular bottoms. Like, I just, I don't understand this. What, it should all just be one? It's one, bottoms. You should be able to change the bottoms fine cool because I guess they gave you the option to just if you wanted pants or if you wanted big pants, if you wanted tights, you can put tights on. But this one, I don't like the Broly because it comes all attached. I feel like the bottoms should be separate. Why aren't the bottoms separate? But they're all the but the tops attached. I don't like that. I don't I don't get that. Why is it like that? It just it's uh, it just makes you not even want to wear this stuff, makes you not even want to rock it, man. Now, um, they did something similar also too with the Namekian. Now the Namekian, if you just put, you put everything on all, all at once, as you're saying, the top and the bottoms for, for the Namekian, that's what I'm talking about, right? So then you can change the pants whenever you want. You can put any pants you want. Now look at this on the female, it will go crazy. Having no pants like this, just having the sash thing looks like a true skirt, like a, like an empress or something, right? This like why can't we put the Namekian stuff on the humans and on the sands and vice versa? Like why why can't we color swap? It's crazy, man, what they're doing to this game. Like they did they tweak minor things to mess up bigger stuff. You know what I mean? We take one small step forward and go five steps back. <laughs> like what is going on? Dibs and Bandai, you guys are losing, okay? <laughs> no, I'm joking. But anyway, that, that, I'm just saying, that's my mini rant. And it also does it for the Journey of the West. Hey, well, that's brand new. So y'all are doing this on purpose. This is brand new. We just got this a month ago. So y'all do y'all doing this on purpose at this point. Right? Like, come on, man. Give us these changes. Change this stuff. Make it better, Dibs and Bandai. That is my plea. Okay, that is my plea. I really love this game. I really want this to last because I feel like it's gonna die when Spark can come out. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. But that would be my mini rant for you guys today. I appreciate you. If you stuck this long, you are an avid customer and I really appreciate you guys. You are real ones and true ones. Remember this number seven. If you stayed this long and you type that comment section seven, I will I'll, I'll tell you, I'm doing a giveaway. I know I say it a lot, but I do do the giveaways, but I am giving away $20 gift card. If you remember this number seven, put it in the comment section if you stayed that long. But I appreciate you guys and rock with everything I had to say. This was a long one, and I'll see y'all in the next episode, man. We got hidden fashions for y'all next up, all right?
Thank you. See y'all in the comment section. Leave a like. Peace. Thank you.